Hi guys, Jeff here. Today I wanted to talk about my approach to my first dimple lock. A buddy a while back sent me this safety dimple lock with the smiley keyway and I was confused for a while. So of course I hit YouTube, I saw some, uh, some of the experts taking care of this and wondered how could I get this lock open myself. So as we talked about in my pick video, I have a lot of windshield wiper inserts on hand and I noticed that the windshield wipers have these little teeth at the end. So I bent them out and realized that I could use one to tension in the corner of that smiley. And then, using my diamond, it was actually short enough that I can just use it as a rake. Tension her back in there. Just rake it back and forth in there. And it opens. And I was happy with that as a first attempt, but I realized I could do better even making it myself at home. So I have spoon handles laying around from some other projects that I do and realized that if I bent an end up, thinned it out, and cut some notches into it, I could tension this from both sides, get that hook, that uh, diamond back here. It takes a little finagling to get that first pin up. But once I get that first pin up, come on. It was so much easier to tension and quicker to get this raked open. Now, raking, of course, is all well and good, but I don't know about you guys, I really prefer single pin picking. So I, again with windshield wiper insert, because it's what I have, have been working on a little flag. Now, it is still a work in progress. I am not completely happy with it yet. Trying to get the right size, the right curve on it, so I can fit in here. Every once in a while, I can get it picked, but it is not every time. If you listen, I didn't even get any pins set that time. So I'm still trying to learn to use this flag, still trying to dial in the size on it, but these, are some of the tools that I have used and I'm working on using for my first dimple lock. I really look forward to getting some other dimple locks so I can refine learning to use my flags. Of course, here in the US, they're not as common, but we work with what we've got, right? Anyways, that's what I have today, and I will talk to you later.